Hello and welcome. So throughout this short tutorial series, we were able to use the Open Weather Map API to create this web app that is used to get the weather data of any city around the world, of about 200,000 cities to be precise, as we have on the Open Weather Map API documentation. Here, we made the API calls by city name, but from the Open Weather Map API, the API calls can be made by city name or city name and country code, by geographical coordinates like longitude and latitude, also by city ID or zip code. But here in this application, we just made the API calls by city name. So if you enter a city name, say London, you're going to get a response here. And the result is in JSON format. But what we did was we were able to get this specific data from the JSON response and we displayed the results here. We have the weather, the description, the temperature, pressure, humidity, speed, direction with their units. Also, we have the weather icon being displayed here. So you can search for uh, different cities around the world. If you type Tallinn, you're going to get this weather information. You type Lagos, you get this weather information as well. You type Oslo. So we can see that we can get different weather information. And these are just current weather data of the city. So we've used the Open Weather Map API. If you go to the Open Weather Map API documentation, you can see we have current weather data, 5-day, 3-hour forecast, 16-day daily forecast. Also historical data and other data as well. So you can explore this Open Weather Map API to use and display other data like the forecast data and the historical data as well. So we've been able to use this. So I implore you to explore the Open Weather Map API well and try to understand and see how you can display other data from it. So if you like this, my tutorial lecture, I will implore you to subscribe to my channel to expect more videos and more tutorial lectures. Thank you and God bless you.